So at the risk of sounding like some fountain-based energizer bunny, a number of you found my last video helpful um, in terms of trying to make it through what are increasingly difficult times. And I know that because um, so many people have been in touch to say that they aren't sure that they can find a way through or they don't know how. Um, I think there's three things that are really important to do at the moment. Uh, number one would be to be really sure of the things you're really sure about. So those could be things about yourself, like basic things like your age, where you live, what you've been through, what you know for certain. So things you're certain about. It could be the fact that you're certain that COVID's not that big a deal, that case numbers aren't the same as deaths. And indeed, people have been lied to if we were told it was about flattening the curve and now we're locking down more things for no reason. You may be certain that you're being lied to. Okay, those are the certainties. Next up, it's really important to clear some of the noise. Um, and I say that, and I mean it about all things in your life. So what are the things in your life that are noisy that don't really help you? Um, I might be one of them. <laughs> so Instagram or friendship groups where people just worry themselves stupid or mums groups where mums are sort of still trying to compete to outdo each other on stupid things like pat lunch boxes. I don't know what. CNN, the news, the TV. Just get rid of noisy things that aren't helping you and in fact are making you feel worse about yourself. Facebook's probably a good example for a lot of people. And then finally, everybody needs to hold on. Um, talk before about this idea that if you just hold on, this will pass and things will get better. Um, I've been through a few things in my life and they all did pass. Um, so find something to hold on to. And that's not always easy and it's not always a person. It might be a photo of a time when you were really happy or someone in your life that really mattered to you. Or it might be a memory of something. Uh, if you hold on to something that makes you happy, I think you can find a way through. So three things to do. What are you certain about? What noise can you get rid of? And go find something to hold on to.